all right guys welcome back to the channel um, this is a different video today I thought about doing a bit of a small youtuber confessional because um, I recently got to 500 subscribers I think that was in the last few days and I've been reflecting on what has been the journey so far and maybe this will help another small youtuber or it's just to get a few things off my chest that's probably what it is um, it's been a journey I have to say uh, it hasn't been a year since I opened the channel I did a couple of changes of uh, branding um, you know the latest one is this and I think that's I'm gonna stick to that one um, but you know honestly I started this I never thought anybody would be interested in what I had to say or show um, it started with me loving my cars and and then wanting to share a bit of you know what I've done working on the cars and if honest if I'm honest I mean I should have started maybe two years ago when I bought the TT and I did a number of modifications to it and I didn't document any of that so I missed that opportunity to show all the uh, modifications to the TT there's still a few things to be done and and I'll try to show those on the channel, but um, yeah, I should have done it before. That's one of the reflections. Um, I think one of the funnest things for me has been involving other people and getting my friends involved, some of my coworkers and even neighbors in, um, in the channel. You'll see them in the promo and in, in a number of the videos. I mean, we have different skills between us. Like I said before, we're not mechanics. Um, we're learning as we go. But we have some people that are braver uh, doing mechanical work. Um, we got people like me and others that are more like detailers and, and you know have a lot of experience detailing cars. And, and um, some of us even try to do some painting of parts and things like that. So I think between us, we definitely um, make a good team and uh, make interesting content, right? And uh, the thing is, I mean, sometimes we succeed, sometimes we don't succeed. You've seen that I post videos when we fail to do an installation or to repair something um, because I think that's part of the experience. I mean, we don't get it right every time and, um, you know, that will continue to be my commitment to just post whatever happens, good or bad. and. And then we learn from it and we try again and um, isn't that what we all experience in our garages I think that's that's what I wanted to um, get through um, the other thing that's been you know very interesting has been analyzing the data I think YouTube provides so much analytical data to understand who's your audience uh, what gets views what doesn't get views uh, uh, what people like what people don't like um, you know what happens you know uh, that generates more traffic than than other things in what device and during what days of the week I mean for people like me that are junkies of data I, I look at it all the time and, and if I'm honest I'm, I don't follow it um, or get schizophrenic about you know posting in the you know perfect days or you know uh, or posting whatever people like the most it's quite obvious that you know exhaust notes and exhaust systems is like like porn <laughs> to car lovers I mean that's that's a given and I'll, I'll, I'll do more videos of that definitely but you know it's uh, I have to be real and in terms of what I'm doing and some of it might less be less interesting than other things and that's that's okay too but for small YouTubers, I mean, the data provided by YouTube is, is fantastic. You can learn a lot and, you know, and, um, and, and look for ways to connect in a, in a better ways, in better ways. Uh, I think the other thing is um, that happened is the, this global pandemic. I mean, that, that threw everything out the door and for not just for me, for every YouTuber, imagine the big ones, right? That, have fully monetized this and this is their job um, I'm sure it's been very very difficult uh, so there's no meats no cars and coffees 
Um, I can't get my friends to work together. Honestly, I get bored working alone in my cars and, you know, um, I like to work with friends and that has been the biggest impact, not being able to be with my friends and, and work together and have a laugh. Um, it's, it hasn't been easy. And then, you know, what content can I create that might be interesting or not? Um, it's, it's been a challenge, right? Um, to the point where I'm sure I'm not the only one that have thought about stopping this altogether, but you carry on, right? And this situation will, will be over hopefully and uh, we can get back to some sort of normal at some point. Um, so, you know, I, I realized at some point I'm providing some sort of entertainment for people. I mean, I, I watched the, the big car YouTubers like Shmi and Doug Demuro and Hoovy, and, and that's what they do too, right? At the end of the day, um, there's a lot more traffic on YouTube because people are at home. So you might as well carry on because this will be over and then, you know, uh, there will be interesting things to put on the channel. Um, so again, I think creating content get my mind of things too. I have to be honest, I use a, a bit of a therapy. Um, I have a day job, it's stressful at times and, you know, uh, creating content, editing videos, <clears throat> all of that process of editing, um, it's, it's therapy, right? It's fun. Um, you can get a little bit creative, not that I, I'm an expert in editing, but you know, I try to make it as, as interesting as, as possible. So that, that has helped during this period too. Um, but it's been a roller coaster, right? And it's going to continue to be a roller coaster for a while. So the important thing is, you know, that I'm going to carry on. Now that I got to 500, never thought I would have 50. <laughs> um, so, you know, I'll continue. Not, I'm not looking, you know, to grow exponentially. If it happens, great. If it doesn't happen and I have, you know, a, a following out there, that's, that's great enough. So, um, I look for ways to create more content for you guys and things that might be interesting and uh, and uh, let's make sure that we stay safe and we follow the guidelines and and uh, as we get out of this we find ways to contribute and help other people I have some ideas about you know how can with my friends get together and, and help those that are in more need and and that would be a good thing right uh, as you have a contain community you can organize it a little bit and and help some people so again stay safe um sorry for the rant here a bit of a a personal a personal experience that i wanted to share and uh, uh looking forward to uh, sharing more content with you guys so see you around mm -hmm.